Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn how we can pick images from device gallery or camera in Flutter. So before any further delay, let's move ahead. We have a simple app showing on the screen and with the title image picker in Flutter. We need a package in Flutter to pick these images and that is known as image picker. So before any further delay, let's navigate to the browser and type image picker in Flutter. Open this link and this is the plugin that we will utilize to pick images. So copy it from here and open your pubspec.yaml file here. Under the dependencies, we need to add this line and then press command plus S or control plus S in Windows and our package will be installed on our app. Now, if you're on iOS, you need some permissions. So we'll navigate to iOS, then runner and then info.plist file. Here you need to add these four lines in order to grant access to your Flutter app so that your Flutter app can pick images from gallery or from camera. So it is needed for iOS. I will add these lines in the pinned comment so that you can take it from there. But you need these lines, otherwise you won't be given access on iOS. For Android, there is no need of such permissions. And now we are good to go to use that package in our Flutter app. So here, now I will make this a stateful widget now in order to uh, pick the images and the status updated. So here we need a file known as, uh, we will be using an image file. It will be of type file and it is from the Dart IO library. And then we will make it a private uh, property and we don't need to assign it anything. We will make it nullable because it will be null by default and when it is picked so we need to update the state and that will be stored here so now here whenever the image is null which means it hasn't been picked so we would like to show some text in the center that will be uh, image not picked or something like that so we will add a check here if this image file equals to null then we need to add some text no image picked and when it is picked, we need to show this image that has been picked. And that picked image is stored in this file. So we will use the image.file widget and then we will add this file here. Since it's nullable, so add this exclamation and we have added this condition here. So it won't be null, we can easily add this exclamation. So here, let's add this n here. And you can see it says no image picked. And whenever we pick image, so an image will be shown here. For that, let's add some button in this uh, scaffold. So we have the floating action button here. So let's add this button. Whenever this button is tapped, we need to handle this event handler. And here down, we will be showing some icon. So let's add this icon and we will add the icon for camera icons dot camera camera alt you can see we have the button being built here here we will add the logic for picking the image for that we need to add a method known as pick image and here we will add the logic for picking the image using the image picker plugin so whenever this on press event handler uh, is detected or it is triggered we would like to use this pick image function here that will pick us the image now let's add the functionality here so we need that image picker here so we will create an instance of the picker and that will be image picker and here we have these different functions pick image and other things that we can use uh, for picking the image so we have created the instance now we will utilize it to pick image we can also instantiate it outside here and let's utilize this picker to pick image to pick image we have this method known as pick image and here we need to provide a source so this source can either be uh, the gallery or the camera so we need to provide it this source which is the image source and so firstly let's add the image source as gallery so it will pick the image from gallery and we need to add await here because it is an async operation it takes time so 
add a weight here and we will add this variable here that will be picked file or picked image so whenever the image is picked so this will be stored in a picked file but there there can be a case when you go to the gallery but you do not pick anything so this file will be null in that case so we add a null check here if picked file not equal to nulls which means that it ensures that the image is being picked so then we need to update this image uh, object so assign this picked file to this image and then we need to update the state add exclamation here oh it is x file so we need to convert it to x file first so we will create this file and we need to pass the path here this picked file is the x file and it has a path so we will utilize that path to create a file from it and then this file will be stored in this file object that is image so it will pick the image for us but we also need to add the set state here so that the state is updated and the ui is rebuilt so from this button we will now be able to pick images and it will be shown here when it is picked so let's restart our app so here we have this button whenever we tap on it we have added the pick image here so it will open our device gallery so tap on it we have some error here and it says no implementation found for method pick image oh we need to rebuild the app in order for it to work so let's rebuild the app some libraries need the app to be rebuilt to in order to work so wait for it and our app is now built again so let's tap on this button and our gallery will open so here it asks for access so we will allow access and from here we can pick images so i will pick this image and you can see it's shown here now so that's how we pick from gallery now we can also pick from the camera so this time let's add camera here and now here if we tap this button oh camera not available we are on ios simulator and ios simulator isn't a real device so it doesn't have this ios camera we can test it on android so let's open android emulator so from here i will open an android emulator and it is pixel for excel here we have this device opened so we will build the app on android to see so we can close this iphone our app is now built on android as well it is an emulator but it gives you the option of camera because it is heavyweight unlike ios simulator so we can test it on android emulator as well but for ios real device the app will work properly with camera access so now let's try it on android emulator so i will tap on this button to see if it gives us access to camera or not you can see this is the camera for this emulator it is just emulating this camera so if we tap on this button so the image will be taken this is the image captured from camera so if i tap on this stick so the image will be picked and this is the cross so if we take this cross then the picked image will become null this will become null and this code won't be executed so if we tap on tick so it will be executed and the image will be added here so that's how it works let's try out the other as well in that case we tap on this cross so in this case uh, this image hasn't been updated but it's the previous image because this line didn't execute it and this picked image was null null was provided here so uh, that's how it works this is it for today's video of image picking in flutter from device and camera in the upcoming videos we will be bringing some more fun tutorials in flutter so stay tuned see you in the next video goodbye